look at getting the job done. The pandemic hit millions of Americans with disabilities in the workforce. But now one organization in Atlanta is helping to place those that were displaced. Take a look. My disability is low vision, or what some people would consider legally blind or partially blind. The eye disease that I have is called retinitis pigmentosa. My primary disability is bipolar disorder. I was diagnosed uh, when I was 21 years old. I've had a lot of challenges when it comes to my employment. People with disabilities are underemployed already, but the impact of COVID-19 has been significant as far as what we've seen here between March of 2020 and February of 2021. We've had an increase of about approximately 27% of people who have lost their jobs during the pandemic and or um, educational opportunities. And the main reasons why they lost the jobs is the fear that that person would catch the COVID-19 and all of a sudden be a high risk of cost to the organization. Disability Link Disability Action Center of Georgia is located in Tucker, Georgia. We provide services to over 10,000 consumers in a year. Employment services, helping people build resumes or looking for a job. Right now, I'm volunteering full-time at Disability Link. I am working on getting a small part-time job at a salon near my home. I had planned on doing all of this last year, but that didn't quite work out for me because we all had to go into lockdown. I was uh, laid off because of the pandemic. I actually did contract work for the federal government. I could not work from home because the type of work I was doing required me to be in front of people. The challenges that I've had at my prior employer uh, when it comes to my disability is accommodations. Um, with this eye disease, my background is finance and I'd love to go back into that. But being a person with low vision, um, you really have to reevaluate where you stand in the workplace. Even though the, the world is opening back up, people with disabilities are the last ones being looked at being hired. What I hope for when it comes to their employment is that they're considered based upon their experience, their education, and not their disability. Well, there's an idea hiring people based on their education, their abilities. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.